the La Carousse has been released in GTA Online as drip feed content. So let's take a look at whether the San Andreas Mercenaries DLC has delivered on this one and whether it's a win for the Los Santos Angels or just another cheap shark card grab by Rockstar Games. My name's Dan, and I'm an old, grumpy gamer. The Panude La Carousse, 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 I don't know. This little dinky car is a two-seater sports car that tops out at 86 miles an hour or around 139 k's and typically goes for just shy of two mil when it's not on special. So let's see what we can do with it. Yeah, really good variety of front bumpers, some good rear bumpers here, quite a few hoods, some great liveries and quite a selection too, number of roofs, quick respray, and let's finish it off with a new set of rims. As with a lot of the other units we've reviewed pre-release, there's not a lot of official info on the stats, but it's essentially a turbo go-kart. It's compact, low slung, and handles like it's on rails. But at 1.99 million, the La Carousse is one of the most expensive in the class. Will I grab it? Yeah, I love bonkers little machines like this, so definitely worth grabbing, and it does handle like it's on absolute rails. Finally, at the time of recording, we have no idea if this is a permanent fixture or Rockstar's just going to leave it in for this week only. Either way, if you're going to grab it, you might as well jump in fairly quickly. And thanks for watching. Stay safe, wash your hands, and we'll see you in the next video.